For the first time ever, researchers at UC San Francisco and UC Berkeley have successfully created a brain-computer interface and artificial intelligence to allow a woman with severe paralysis to speak through a digital avatar. What sets this achievement apart is that it is the first time in history that not only speech but also facial expressions have been synthesized from brain signals. Furthermore, the system is capable of decoding these signals into text at an impressive speed of nearly 80 words per minute, far surpassing the capabilities of existing commercial technology. The ultimate goal of the research team is to restore a full embodied form of communication as it is considered to be the most natural way for humans to interact with each other. This latest breakthrough brings them one step closer to achieving this vision. Previous experiments conducted by the team demonstrated the possibility of decoding brain signals into text in a man who had also experienced a brainstem stroke. However, the current study takes things a step further by decoding brain signals into the intricacies of speech, including the movements that animate a person's face during a conversation. The scientists implanted a paper-thin rectangle containing 253 electrodes onto the surface of the woman's brain, specifically in areas that have been identified as critical for speech. These electrodes intercepted the brain signals that would have ordinarily commanded muscles in her tongue, jaw, larynx and face, had it not been for the stroke. These signals were then transmitted through a cable connected to a port fixed to her head, which ultimately led to a bank of computers that processed the data. Over the course of several weeks, the participant worked closely with the research team to train the artificial intelligence algorithms of the system to recognize her unique brain signals associated with speech. Through the repetition of various phrases from a conversational vocabulary of 1,024 words, the computer was able to identify the specific brain activity patterns linked to sound production. Interestingly, instead of training the AI to recognize entire words, the researchers devised a system that decodes words from phonemes, the smallest subunits of speech. By adopting this approach, the computer only needed to learn 39 phonemes to decipher any word in English, significantly improving accuracy and speed. To generate a voice, the team developed an algorithm capable of synthesizing speech. They personalized this algorithm to mimic the participant's voice prior to her injury, utilizing a recording of her speaking at her wedding. This added a sense of familiarity and belonging to the vocal output of the system. In order to animate the digital avatar, the researchers collaborated with Speech Graphics, a company specializing in AI-driven facial animation software. Using customized machine learning processes, the team integrated the company's software with the brain signals generated by the woman as she attempted to speak. Essentially, these signals were converted into the corresponding movements of the avatar's face, including the opening and closing of the jaw, the protrusion and pursing of the lips, the movement of the tongue up and down, as well as various facial expressions such as happiness, sadness and surprise. Looking to the future, the team aims to create a wireless version of the BCI, eliminating the physical connection between the user and the system. This would greatly enhance the usability and practicality of the technology, offering greater freedom and independence to individuals with paralysis. The successful development of MindSpeak, as the system is called, marks a significant step towards restoring the ability to communicate effectively for those who have lost it due to neurological conditions or injuries. As this technology continues to advance, it has the potential to revolutionize the lives of millions worldwide, giving them a voice that transcends the limitations of their physical disabilities. Meanwhile, Unitary Robotics from China just gave the world a glimpse of their latest creation, the H1 humanoid robot. This general-purpose robot, touted by the company as the highest performance in its class, has already captured the attention of tech enthusiasts and robotics aficionados alike. In the video, H1 confidently strides down a street, demonstrating its impressive autonomous navigation capabilities. Equipped with advanced features such as 3D LiDAR and a depth camera, the robot effortlessly maneuvers through its surroundings with grace and precision. Interestingly, H1 even withstands a series of kicks, showcasing its durability and stability. Standing at an impressive height of 71 inches and weighing 47 kilograms, H1 exhibits a walking speed of 3.4 miles per hour, comparable to that of an average human. The company is currently working on developing robotic hands and flexible fingers for H1, further expanding its range of capabilities and potential applications. 
As for its robotic appendages, the H1 robot has six degrees of freedom in each leg and four degrees of freedom in each arm with a battery capacity of 15 amp hours that powers its dual onboard Intel i7 chips. While Unitree has not revealed a specific release date for H1, the company has expressed its plans for commercialization within the next three to 10 years. This ambitious timeline demonstrates Unitree's commitment to advancing humanoid robot technology and making it more accessible to the masses. Before H1, Unitree Robotics had already made a name for itself in the robotics industry with its line of quadruped robots. Plus, earlier this year, the company unveiled the Go2, a four-legged robot that showcases their embodied AI technology. Capable of multi-terrain navigation, climbing stairs, playing fetch, taking photos and even playing music, the Go2 has been hailed as the pet of the future. And in another AI breakthrough, researchers may have found a groundbreaking solution to evaluate the performance of language models with the introduction of Agent Sims, an architecture designed to curate evaluation tasks for large language models. By combining interactivity, visual appeal and programmability, Agent Sims aims to revolutionize the way researchers assess the capabilities of LLMs. One of the main issues with current evaluation methods is the reliance on human raters, which can be costly and time-consuming. To address this challenge, researchers have turned to LLMs themselves, using automatic raters based on well-aligned models like GPT-4. While this approach has its merits, it falls short when it comes to analyzing supra-GPT-4 level models. Agent Sims tackles these limitations by providing a user-friendly interface that streamlines the task design process. The architecture is designed to remove barriers for researchers with varying levels of programming expertise, making it accessible to specialists in diverse fields, from behavioral economics to social psychology. By offering features like map generation and agent management, Agent Sims empowers researchers to create environments and design evaluation tasks easily, without requiring extensive technical knowledge. One of the key advantages of Agent Sims is its extensibility and combinability. Researchers in the LLM field can explore the effects of combining multiple plans, memory systems, and learning systems using this architecture. This opens up new possibilities for experimentation and innovation in AI research. Moreover, Agent Sims offers significant improvements over existing large language model benchmarks. Unlike traditional benchmarks that only test a limited number of skills and rely on data and criteria open to interpretation, Agent Sims allows for explicit goal-driven evaluation. By modifying abstracted agent planning, memory and tool use classes, AI professionals and developers can experiment with various LLM support systems and determine objective task success rates. The introduction of Agent Sims marks a critical milestone in the development of robust LLM benchmarks. By facilitating cross-disciplinary collaboration and enabling the creation of varied social simulations, this architecture has the potential to reshape the way AI models are evaluated. Furthermore, its user-friendly design ensures that researchers from all backgrounds can contribute to the growth and advancement of the LLM sector.